Right, hello and back to episode 26 of the Rangers career and here we are, we're going to start into some Europa League action against Rosenberg and Ibrox. Hopefully we can get the job done, the ball gets played in though, two Kuronson, great save from uh, Sebastian Farr, I think that is. But pitch clearance from Rudiger and it results in a Rosenberg goal. And to be honest, could you expect anything more? I mean, it was just pure pitch. I mean, obviously he's not going to miss from there from that pitch back pass, just look at the state of this. I mean... <laughs> Probably the best pass I delivered all game. Anyway, though, Rosenberg with another chance. And he hits it into, like, the... Well, it didn't even hit the side net, but it was almost the side net. And now we play the ball into Sané. Sané strikes, but it's a good uh, block from the Rosenberg defender. But sadly, that is the way the game finished. To finish 2-0. Rosenberg, the boy smashed this. And Slatan just smashes them. He just goes right through the back of one of their midfielders. Slatan not taking too well. They're not getting on the score sheet. To be honest, can you blame the guy? No, you probably can't because it's been a pitch performance by Mackay, though. Tries to launch the ball over the top, and it's very bloody warm. It's about 18 degrees in here. A lot about 18 on that. 36. Preston, though, we draw with them. Pesh into the next game against Wolves in the EFL Cup. We win 1-0. Barry Mackay in extra time, putting that game to bed. Now we play Ipswich in the championship. Hopefully we can get the job done here. Now we win 5-1. And to be honest, that is the definition of getting the job done. Jesus, got the hiccups. My all. all right, into the second game of the episode. Though it's against Malmo, and it's another game in the Europa League. And considering we lost the first game. Or was that the second game? I can't even remember. I do not know, but... No, it was the first game, definitely the first game. But Ian Acho, though, Ian Acho with a run of his own. Strikes, bottom left. No saving that one. Keeper, he's just... Pesh, Ian Acho, 86 rate. I mean, he's just great. He's better than Rashford. Ian Acho on fire in the away kit, and so is the rest of the team. And we're actually playing a B team in this match, if you believe it. But Ian Acho there for free kick. Maybe a bit adventurous, you know. Oliver Burke, though, hits it in. Andy Halliday makes it 2-0. And to be honest, this game has basically been put to bed. Malmo showing no threat on the counter or any sort of attack they do. But here we go, Safari. And he could have easily made it 2-1. And that could have put the pressure on us with like a few minutes to go. But Nico Kranskar with a strike from distance. And that uh, doesn't really trouble anyone. Caballero kicks the ball up. And Ian Acho wins it, but it goes straight to the Malmo guy, and that's the way it finished. 2-0 to us. Pretty comfortable win, if you ask me. And now into a sim game against Birmingham in the, the league. And we actually get beat. I mean, our league form this season has just been no good. And another game in the league against Hall City at home, but we always win the home games. Hopefully we can smash them. Please. Come on. 3-0. Ibra and Mackay. Let's have a look at the league table. To be honest, I'm surprised for sick. It's basically just draws. Like We're not really losing that many games. That was the first game we actually lost there against Birmingham. Anyway, though, we've got a few games coming up next. We've got a game against, two. is that? QPR. Let's get stuck into that. And as you can see, Chris Benoit now is on the left-hand side of the screen because I forgot to take him off after I did that Halloween draft. But we drew one each there with QPR. And now we're playing against... Lokomotiv Moscow and hopefully we can get the job done another one in the Europa League ball falls to some black man now it falls to Andy Halliday takes about 8 deflections on the way through but it's actually made its way through and to be honest that is all that matters 1-0 to us do you look who plays in Van Bergen who's back from injury after missing 3 months after he scored in his debut like that would be depressing but you know that's basically all that happened in this game I mean like I know you could moan oh why haven't you put enough highlights in but if you want to just see Pish half chances, and then be my guest. But anyway, here we go against Leeds in the league. So hopefully we can get another win. Another three points to move further up the table from sixth. Now I'm a win free one, so a pretty comfortable win there in the end. And let's see what else is happening. We're against Preston in the EFL Cup away from home. This should be another comfortable win. And it's a 2-1 win. Angelino with two goals. A left back getting a double. That's a wee bit weird, like. And let's see, though, into the final game of the episode. It's us against Rotherham away from home. Hopefully we can smash them. Players warming up. 3-2 result. That is all you want. But really, this will do it for episode 26 of the Rangers career mode. 
next game, Europa League and Celtic. Next episode even, but until then, peace.